Welcome to your French class. In this class, we are going to learn how to make adjective plural and feminine. First, let's understand the purpose of using adjective. They modify nouns. They must agree in gender and number with nouns. Here we have got some sentences to fill them with the right form of adjective. So let's start with the first one. Sentence number one. Les filles sont intelligentes. The girls are intelligent. Now here we have used the adjective intelligent with E and S. This time we are talking about feminine plural case. So first we added E to make the adjective feminine. Then we have added S to make it plural. Intelligent. Now sentence number two. La maison est grande. Which means the house is big. Now maison is feminine. So we have added E in the adjective grand. And now it will be read like grand. Sentence number three. Paul et Pierre sont méchants. That means Paul and Pierre are mean or naughty. Now we have added S in méchant because this time we are talking about masculine plural. Now sentence number four. Sophie est blonde. That means Sophie is blonde. Now here we have used the adjective blanc. And we added E at the end of blanc because this time we are talking about feminine singular. Blonde. Sentence number five. Voici une jolie cravate. That means here is a pretty tie. Now the given noun cravate is feminine. So we have added E in the adjective jolie. Jolie cravate. Now sentence number six. La chambre est petite. Now the given noun chambre is feminine, so we have used e in the adjective petit, and now it is petit. Now sentence number seven: Les professeurs sont espagnols. Now again, the given noun is masculine plural, so we have added s in the given adjective. Here we are talking about a nationality that is espagnol. Now it means the teachers are Spanish. Now sentence number eight: Les chats sont jolis. It means the cats are pretty. Now the given noun les chats is masculine plural, so we have added s in the adjective jolie. Now sentence number nine: Regardez la jolie image. That means look at the pretty picture. Now the given word image is feminine, so we have added e in the adjective jolie image. Now sentence number 10. Les étudiants sont gentils. That means the students are nice or kind. Now les étudiants is feminine plural. So first we'll double the letter L. Then we'll add E and S. Because we are talking about a feminine plural noun. Gentil. Now sentence number 11. Le livre est jaune. That means the book is yellow. Now, the given noun le livre is masculine, so we have written Jean and E is already there in the spellings, so we are not going to remove this E. Le livre est jaune, it means the book is yellow. Now, sentence number 12. Steffi et Lisa sont souriantes. That means Steffi and Lisa are smiling. Now, the given noun is feminine plural. Here we are talking about two girls, so we'll add E and S in Sruhiont. Now sentence number 13. C'est une nouvelle bibliothèque. That means it's a new library. Now the given noun bibliothèque is feminine so we'll use nouvelle. Now sentence number 14. Les femmes sont jolies. The women are pretty. Now the given noun is feminine plural so we'll add E and S in jolie. La leçon est ennuyeuse. That means the lesson is boring. Now the given noun is feminine, la leçon. So we are going to use the feminine adjective, ennuyeuse. Sentence number 16. C'est un bel appartement. It is a beautiful apartment. Now the given noun appartement is starting with a vowel and it is masculine. So we are going to use bel, bel appartement. Now sentence number 17. Vaughn aime le chat noir. 
that means Varun likes the black cat. Now the given noun Lucia is masculine. So we are going to write the masculine form of noir. Sentence number 18. Les oiseaux sont noirs. Now here the given noun les oiseaux is masculine plural. So we'll add S in the masculine form of the given adjective noir. Sentence number 19. C'est un vieil homme. It means he is an old man. Now here the given noun homme is masculine and starting with a vowel. So we'll use the masculine vowel form of vieux. Now sentence number 20. La souris est méchante. It means the mouse is naughty. Now the given noun la souris is feminine. So we are going to add e in méchant. And after adding e it will be read like méchante. So this is how we place adjective according to the gender and number of the given noun. So that's it for today. See you in the next video. Till then. Bye bye.